All right, Journal Star quick shift with Riverman head coach Jean-Guy Trudel. I'm going to break down this uh, piece of tape here. What are we looking at, Coach? Well, right now we looked at a face-off. I wanted to explain really quick on face-offs what we do when we lose a face-off, that we want to puck back in three uh, three seconds. So for us, our rotations are key. Uh, on the strong side or on the weak side would have been a deep pinching. And then we're going to go through the offensive zone rotations. We have about 10, 11 different ones. We have about five points of releases that we use a lot. So right now on the face-off, we lost a face-off. Reichardt and uh, McCormick right on. Then our center, his job is to take the reverse. So which he did really well, released it behind the net. Reich's is first there, okay? And we like to be behind the net or use the back of the net a lot. As you can see, McCormick, okay? We have, we'd have we like McCormick to chase the dot, which he's doing a little bit later there. And then we don't want to be predictable on our cycles, as you can see. And then McCormick gets open. So we'll go back quick. So lost face off, center takes a wall. If it'd be going on the weak side, it'd be our deep pinching. But right now our two fours do their job. We take, then we release behind the net. That's one of our releases. Reich's does a great job being there first, releases behind the net again. Now we have time. We chase the dots with Reichs. Nothing there. Doesn't want to have a block shot. Should start. The dive should become earlier by the D there. It's a little bit late on Neville's part to dive, but that's okay. We're still uh, moving our feet offensively all the time, and I love there how McCormick went back door to get open. So Great for shot, us, geez. yeah, for our rotation like this one, if the puck would come all the way around, would be our deep pinching on 44 down there on the screen. But since it's a reverse, it's our center taking the reverse. And again, our second quick are, are really important. As you can see, McCormick was there second quick. We, we want to funnel to the net, as you can see, with uh, Carvalho in front of the net. And I always say if Carvalho is in front of the net, when one of their D becomes four on four in zone. So more time, more space for everybody else to do their plays. And then a great rotations by the two guys, okay, going where they need to be. So all those things in Peoria are really important, which is chasing the dots, doing your rotations, your release points, understanding where it's safe to release, especially against a team like Huntsville, where they like to go and attack really quick and transition really quick. Our release behind the net was really important those games. And uh, we did it really well the first night, second night, not so much, but hey, they're the champs for a reason and uh, they bring up bass. But I, I said it's a good thing for us. going to give us a little bit of motivation here for the, uh, to, for the break until Christmas time. We'll, uh, we'll have a little bit of motivation get back on the winning track. Perfect. That's quick shift for the week with head coach John Guy Trudell. Thanks, coach. Thank you.